thieves stole some pricey air conditioning units from a building in Detroit, but they probably didn't have any idea they may have been stealing from the police. Action News reporter Cheryl Choden is live on Detroit's East Side right now where this all unfolded. Cheryl? Well, Carolyn, you never know if they want the whole unit or the copper or the metal for scrap, but you do know that it doesn't belong to them, and we do know that this could eventually belong to the police. Two huge cooling units are missing from a building on Connor that's in the process of being sold, taken by thieves, reportedly within the past two weeks. The question is, did the bad guys know? This is the proposed site of the new 5th police precinct. I think that's just awful. While neighbors who live nearby are happy to hear the police will likely be moving in, they are disturbed to hear someone took those units because they say if someone would make it over the fence and haul away the heavy air conditioners, they would go to great lengths to take anything else they wanted. It makes everyone worried what's going to be next if they are that low to take something that desperate. And if they'll take it from a building, they'll take it from anyone. Well, if they take it from their neighbors, look what they're doing to the police. This has become a serious theft problem in the city and the suburbs, and many say it's just ironic that thieves would take from the very men and women who might be looking for them in the near future. If you take something from the police, what's going to happen next when they come up to you? And if they come up to them and if they find them, police will arrest them and prosecute them, whether the air conditioning units are from this building or another. Reporting live on the city's east side, I'm Cheryl Choden, Channel 7 Action News.